Uh, hello everyone, um, I'm Amir. I, I'm, I want to talk about how we can get uh, new languages working in ORS. First of all, I want to talk about what's ORS and uh, how, what it does. ORS is actually, in, uh, people think uh, ORS is something to fight vandalism, but it's not. Uh, ORS is actually basically it's uh, infrastructure to use AI in Wikipedia, like uh, adding um, everything that you can think of using artificial intelligence is actually based in ORS and we can use it in um, Wikipedia. But, but right now we only support edit quality and article quality and what these uh, two mean First, uh, article quality means uh, if edit is vandalism or not, or it's made in good faith, what type of edit is uh, this, and um, what it does, or uh, actually it's helping the article or not. And article quality actually talks about if the article should be uh, considered as a featured article, or uh, is it still needs um, work. In order to get edit quality basic support uh, for any languages, any new languages, we need uh, first, uh, for basic support, we need two things. First is language utilities like list of bad words and list of informal words. Bad words are, um, um, are words that you cannot use in Wikipedia at all, not in talk pages, not in articles like, uh, swear words, curse words that you use uh, in everyday life. But uh, um, you can use uh, like words in like hey in uh, article name. Uh, you cannot use them in article name space, but you might go there and say hi to your friend in a talk page uh, and it's okay to use them. And we need to distinguish. And one thing that we can use that is Getting a list, uh, we have a tool that generates list of bad words, uh, and I can show it to you. And let's go there. And. It's not there. Um, we can go somewhere else later. This is a list of bad words in English, and I'm not trying to show it to you. And uh, it's being generated by uh, an LP, NLP, a artificial intelligence tool that uh, gets uh, all of the history of Wikipedia and tries to understand if uh, edits are there are reverted or not. And if they are reverted, um, it tries to understand what are the common words in reverted edits and what are not the common words. Uh, and they are not common in not reverted edits. So basically it tries to uh, guess a list of uh, words we shouldn't use. If you use in articles, it probably get reverted. And uh, for training data, actually we do not need uh, anything from you, but actually we do it and we mm, uh, get the data. But if the wiki is a bot video, like uh, some wikis has more than 70%, 60% of it made by bots, and that's not a, that's not a thing that uh, we can, it messes with our data and messes with, um, our uh, system, so we need to do something else. For, we have, for example, we had for Wikidata, we had to actually go through dumps to find out, um, and we checked about 25 million edits to get some edits that are uh, uh, reverted and needs to be reviewed by people. But for advanced support, we need uh, something else, like um, you need to go th uh, have a wiki labels which it is in this place. And I can show it up to you 
and then you need to go through several edits. It depends on the language, but mostly it's, it'll, be, it'll be about 5,000 edits that needs to be reviewed by you. And I hope it works. I don't know. Let's try it in another language. We just disconnected, yeah. And it's, it has a system like this, and it says, okay, uh, is it a good, or is it damaging or not? If it's damaging, yes, a good faith, no. And we save it. And it uh, stores uh, data for that edit, and uh, once it's done by community or uh, several people, for example, in Wikidata, actually we had, um, 37 people who labeled data until we get this done. And you can use, it, use this URL to see if that's the case. And at, after that, uh, once it's done, we can uh, have advanced support for your wiki. It's called damaging model and a good faith model. Let me show it to you. So you can see some wikis have uh, damaging support because they finished their campaigns, but some wikis are just have the reverted model. Reverted model is actually the basic support. The uh, accuracy is much lower than damaging and good faith. But uh, and another thing is that good faith uh, can determine if the user is vandalism, is a uh, is a vandal or not, and that's uh, that's that can help a lot in. Uh, finding new users that are making mistakes, but they are doing it probably in good faith. And uh, that's, um, that can help, uh, like there is research that shows uh, users uh, using Clubot NG or automatic uh, systems that reverse vandalism uh, actually causes reduce in new user retention. Because if you're a user and you're doing an honest mistake and a bot completely uh, reverts you, it doesn't feel really good. But if the user is just a new user and someone comes and talks to him and or her and tells, okay, your edit has a problem, and in that case, it can um, make more uh, social interaction and makes the person uh, likely to stay and then we have, after we have the damaging support, we can have a beta feature enabled for you. I want to show it to you if Wikidata. No, no. You need to simply go to beta features and in in bottom there is a called ORS and when you enable it you can go to recent changes and you will see some edits. Uh, let me show it Persian Wikipedia for you because Wikidata is too big. Okay, you can see some edits are marked as they should be reviewed and if you, you have a, an option to just hide every good edit, and you can see this edit needs to be reviewed. And, and also, you can go to your preferences and change or its sensitivity. What do you call it, recent changes? Hi. And uh, when you, you don't have some time to review edits, you just need to go there and number of edits that it takes would be much lower. So the time span uh, for this uh, list would be much bigger. For article quality models, uh, there is a model for uh, some languages, including English Wikipedia, 
uh, it works based on Oracle assessment system. And that's the system that uh, works in English Wikipedia. You call an uh, article is featured or not featured, uh, featured, good. Um, but what's, what's after good? Like a, a article, B article, C, start and stop. And these are um, the model English Wikipedia has. And based on how it works, uh, we will build a system for you if you want to. Scores English Wikipedia. And you can see there's a WP10 for. So in that case, uh, it shows that in uh, revision number something, in that case, an article like this would be declared as a start or, and there is a probability. So basically there is a very few probability that this article should be considered as a good, as a featured or good article, but there's a rather high, high probability that this uh, article should be considered as a star article or the article. And if you have a system, if you have a system of article assessments, like you have featured, good, and several other uh, classifications, and you can simply just ask us and we will build a WP10 model for you, and it works and it helps a lot. For example, if you want to um, have, a, uh, have something that in English it works, there's a called wiki project. In wiki projects, you can go there and see if the article it needs reassessment. Like if the article was uh, considered as a B class article and uh, some time has passed on and it got improved and now it should be considered as a, a featured article or good article. And in that case, we can tell you, we can tell you that this article needs to be reassessed. And it's a, it, it was helpful for Wiki Project Medicine. And I think if you want to just come to us and talk to us and we will, built the model for you. I think there are just a few wikis that has this model already. Um, scores. Let me show it to you. Uh, there's English Wikipedia and French Wikipedia and that's it. There are two wikis that has this model, and you can uh, have it too. Any questions? Thank you.